Well, happy Sunday again, y'all. <laughs> you have just tuned in to the Eyes Married Now Show, okay? Channel 100, a.k.a. 100, okay? This is where you're going to get the real deal, okay? Ain't going to be no nonsense foolishness over here now. There might be some foolery, honey, because you know I get a little crazy sometimes, honey. But it's going to be 100, okay? 100 foolery and foolishness. <laughs> Honey, okay, so what we got here is uh, an envelope, honey, okay, and inside the envelope, honey, would be another envelope, and inside uh, another envelope, honey, would be uh, the discussion of the day, <laughs> honey, so we got an envelope, bam, Another envelope in uh, uh, the discussion. Okay. All right. Now, in case you new on my channel, honey, uh, I got cue cards. Okay. Sometimes I have cue cards. Okay. Because if I have a lot of things to talk about, I need little notes just to remind me to talk about it now. As far as the actual conversation, honey, that's all live and straight off the top. Okay. But I got little notes. So that I can remind myself, talk about this, and talk about that, talk about that. You know what I'm saying, y'all. Because I'm getting older, so you know what I'm saying. My mind don't always click right, okay? But mama good, though, okay? All right, now, here we go. First of all, y'all, I need to do a repair, okay? Because I just finished my nails, honey. And honey, the producer came out and said, honey, welcome to the show. And welcome us. All right, now I came out the dressing room like, oh! Up our nail. So we're gonna first do a repair, okay? <laughs> and honey, while we speaking of nails, I just want to say, y'all, oh yeah, so yeah, let's see what we're gonna do here today. I'm sorry, y'all. Just a little reminder of what I'm gonna talk about. Okay, because mm -hmm, mama can get sidetracked, honey, start doing her own thing. <laughs> And all of this is my own thing, but you know, I have an agenda for this video, okay? All right. So, we're going to start off with a repair, okay? And while we're doing a repair, and uh, by the way, the color of the day is pink, okay? All right now. So, we rocking pink today, y'all. It's a hot pink, actually. Honey, I'm not left-handed, so this don't go off too well. But I try, okay? But anyway, y'all, I had um, posed a question to you all. And I wanted to know, honey, what could I do about the natural nail girl, honey, with the chip and polish issues, okay? And um, I had asked that question on one of my other videos, honey, and y'all sent me some feedback, a little help, what y'all thought might work. Try this, try that. And uh, let me first just tell y'all what I do already. Because, honey, I've been trying to figure out this thing for years with this natural nail polish stuff, honey. And I have, and I have had expensive polishes honey and i re I resorted back to my dollar polishes because it don't matter whatever you put on there honey it's gonna chip off <laughs> so we back to the dollar uh polishes honey and uh and that's pink in case you ain't see the last video honey that's called hot pink in my book okay now the official name honey i don't know because mama ain't got on no reading glasses so it's some kind of savvy uh look oh <laughs> color a hot pink. All right, so we're going to put that there. Now, what I do, I'm going to tell y'all what I do, and then I'm going to tell y'all some people gave me some advice. And somebody was saying, honey, if you get, find out what's going on with the nail thing, honey, let me know. So I'm going to let you know. Now, I bought this nail hardener. When I did my haul, it's called Ultra Nail Hardener. So what I do is I change my nail polish every day here lately because I'm doing this color of the day, okay? So, um... I take my nail polish off and I apply this nail hardener as a, I guess you would call it a base coat, okay? Then I let that dry. Then I apply my uh, liqueur, okay? My color of the day nail polish, okay? Now, I have applied a top coat before, but um, I does this like right on set sometimes, so I don't be having time for no top coat. Um, but even with top coats, honey, I have done top coats, honey, and it still be chipping, but y'all, but I, I appreciate y'all who have told me try a, some people say try a good top coat, 
Um, and I guess that would be a more expensive top coat because, honey, my top coats be a dollar, okay? All right. Just letting y'all know, okay? Um, yeah, so I thank you, Miss Uniquely Designed, um, Queen to be 1000. A couple of y'all threw it out there to use a, um, a, a good top coat, try a top coat. So I appreciate y'all and whoever else had said, um, use a top coat. I appreciate that information, honey, but honey, <laughs> and yes, I gotta tell y'all, honey, first of all, uh, Rena Winningham, okay, Thank you, honey. I appreciate it. She told me to go to Sally's Beauty Supply, and it's a, a top coat called Buki Acrylic, okay? Now, I don't know if I'm saying that right. Bucky, Boosie, I'll spell it for y'all, okay? And y'all can figure out the proper uh, <laughs> uh, pronunciation. <laughs> honey, it's called Buki. It's called, it's spelled B-U-C-C-I Acrylic. A-C-R-Y-L-I-C -I -I top coat. And she even gave me a price, honey. $3.99. So you already know what you're getting into before you get to Sally's, okay? Thank you, Rena, girl. I appreciate that, honey. And I'm surely gonna go to Sally's, honey, and check it out. Yes, I am. And I will let y'all know the results of the, uh, Bouquet acrylic <laughs> top coat. All right, y'all. But yeah, y'all, so thank you, Miss Rena, for that information. I'm gonna try that out now, honey. Tell y'all, Miss Marquita, 83. Thank you, boo. Honey, you laid it down, okay? I'm going to tell y'all about what Miss Marquita, 83, said, honey. She said, use a top coat, a fast-drying one, in case you're busy, you know, because I smart right now do shows, so I'm busy, you know what I'm saying. So I ain't got time for all that slow stuff, honey. I need stuff to dry quick. See what I'm saying? Y'all ain't got time to... Y'all know what I'm saying. And, yeah, I'm going to tell y'all about this fan later on in my video, y'all. But, yeah, I ain't got time for that. I need something fast drying. Yeah, Miss Marquita. So, yeah, she said a, a good, fast drying top coat. Then she says you need to seal in the nail liquor. <laughs> Honey, she said nail liquor, okay? <laughs> Honey, I love it, okay? She says seal in the nail liquor with your top coat and use a base coat. So that the nail look her <laughs> can adhere, honey. She said adhere, okay? <laughs> she ain't say oh, so it could just stay on. Honey, she said adhere, okay? You know the adhesiveness of things. So that the uh, nail look her can adhere to the base coat, okay? And she also says she has videos on nail care, y'all, on her channel. Well, honey, Marquita83, honey, I have not tuned in yet to check it out, honey, but I will, okay? It's on my list of things to do and things to see, okay? So what I need to do is go on YouTube and type in your little name, honey, okay? What I need to see is your uh, videos on nail care, honey, okay? So yeah, honey, check out Marquita83. M-A-R-Q-U-I-T-A-83, because some of y'all was asking me, you know, if I find out, you know, the trick to keeping your nails from chipping off, honey, to let you know. Miss Ann had asked, um, let her know, well, Miss Ann, honey, Marquita 83, she got some nail liquor information, honey, on her channel, okay? Uh, so check her out, y'all. Mm-hmm. And uh, Miss Rena Winningham uh, said, you can go to Sally's, honey, and get some Buki acrylic for $3.99, okay? So, yeah, honey, there you go. That's the, okay. So, yeah, we're going to cross that off our list, y'all, honey. Mm-hmm, clear polish and stuff, y'all. All right, now, next thing we're going to talk about. We're going to talk about Mama's look of the day, honey, and how it was achieved, Okay. You want to know how I arrived at this color of the day look? Wow, all right. So what I have done, and wait a minute, y'all, let me wet my whistle, because, honey, I'm thirsty, okay? Mm. Oh, and, uh, yeah, I got a little pink cup today, y'all. Mm -hmm. On purpose. Yeah, it's on purpose, honey. Yes, honey, I have a purpose for things that I do, okay? Yeah, mm, excuse me, y'all, because I don't want to mess up my lippy. <laughs> Honey, I love that word lippy, honey. I don't know who started that, but honey, all the years I've ever known it, it was called lipstick, honey. Now they call it a lippy, honey. So I'm right on track with y'all, honey. It's called a lippy, and I don't want to mess up my lippy. <laughs> so excuse me, y'all. I'm sorry, y'all. I am thirsty, mm, and that's water, by the way, y'all. Mm -hmm. All right, so now. Let me 
to show y'all, honey. The palette that I use for the day, y'all, honey. I'm talking about, I'm using some official words, honey. Palette. So the palette of the day has no name, okay? <laughs> honey, it's called a no-namer, okay? And if you want to know where to get stuff that don't have no name, go to the Dollar Tree, honey. Go to your local Dollar Tree, okay? Because that's where I got this from. Mm-hmm, ain't going to lie. Yes, I did. I went to the Dollar Tree. Honey, because that was beautiful. And when I did my haul from the Dollar Tree, y'all, I did not show y'all this, honey. I don't know how we missed it. But, honey, look at that. Beautiful. I love these colors, okay? So, I used this palette. It doesn't have a name. Now, when I bought it, it was in packaging, and I believe it was L.A. Colors, because a lot of their um, uh, makeup that I get from there is from um, L.A. Colors. Although, some of the few items that I got, one or two items that I got when I did my haul was by Milani. But L.A. Colors is usually what it is, so I, I guess. I don't know. But anyway, and this is another um, palette. This is an old one that I bought from the Dollar Tree by L.A. Colors. Let me open it up so y'all can see. So these are the two palettes that I use for the day, honey, to accomplish my looks, okay? Um... And what I did was, my bottom lid, I used this color. It's like a hot pink. Now, it didn't exactly come off looking like this. This is really hot pink looking here. But when I actually put it on, it didn't quite look like that. But that's fine. No problem, honey. We just used that. Then, we went into our um, cut crease, honey. Mama is calling it, honey. I'm not calling it right, La La and um, Platinum and y'all. Miss Pure Eye Candy. Am I saying it right? Miss Jonesy. Oh, I'm sorry. Not Miss Jonesy. Jonice, honey. Honey, we got to get that right, honey, because she's flawless. <laughs> yeah, honey. Fashionista La La and uh, Miss Jonice and Pure Eye Candy, y'all. Did I say that right? Cut crease, y'all. Well, anyway, y'all. I did my cut crease, y'all, with this color right here. It's like a a lighter pink okay I suppose then I did under the brow bone honey <laughs> honey under the brow bone okay I took this lighter color right here which looked pink to me honey and I put that under my brow bone okay so yeah and then um I did um my inner eye tear duct Okay, with some loose powder, honey. Bam, honey. Call it loose eyeshadow powder, honey. Straight from the Dollar Tree, y'all. Yes, I did. Honey, it's by LA Colors. It's uh, eyeshadow. It's loose eyeshadow with a brush in it. And I did my inner eye tear duct with that. <laughs> honey, I'm calling it. All right, so we done talked about cut crease. Brow bone, honey, and inner eye tear duck. Okay, all right. So those were the colors that I used to achieve what uh, I had did on my eyes, y'all. And uh, yeah, mm -hmm. um, and the brushes that I use. Let me show y'all what I use, y'all. Cause see, I don't really know nothing about these brushes, y'all. I got a bunch of brushes, honey. I don't have a clue. Okay, uh, but these are the two that I use to accomplish my little thing. Okay. I don't know the names of these brushes, honey. I can give them a name. Okay, we can start off with this one. Bam, it's called a brush. <laughs> and, honey, I took um, some primer, and I used this brush, and I put some primer on my lid, my entire lid, I, um, on my under eye lid, up in my uh, inner duct area, because I wanted my um, eyeshadow to adhere, honey. <laughs> Go ahead, Miss Marquita, girl. I wanted my eyeshadow to adhere to my eye lids, okay? All right, so yeah, that's why I put primer on, honey, because it helps my eyeshadow to adhere to it, okay? All right, now, girl, Marquita, to her, honey, you was laying it out, okay? Look cool. <laughs> Yeah, so that's what I did. I put my primer on, y'all. Then I took this brush, honey. This is a, a, a angle brush, honey. Um... That's all I know because it's on an angle. Looks like they cut some of the brushes off and it slants. So I took this and I did my, my bottom lid, y'all, with this color here. And then um, I wiped it off and then I put some on this little edges here. And I did my um, cut crease. 
with this color and did my inner um no and did my under the eye with that same color so i did my cut crease and i bought it around okay i don't know if that was right y'all i'm practicing honey miss fearless femi said uh play in your makeup and that's what i did <laughs> okay yeah so all right so yeah y'all and then i took same brush because I like this brush, okay? Let's just put it like that. I got some other brushes, honey, but I don't know, honey, what to do with these things. But anyway, so I did my top, my eye, my um, brow bone with this color that I showed y'all, okay? Honey, then I took this brush right here, honey, and I blended, honey. That is the key. That's what they told me, honey. You got to blend, okay? So I blended all that together, honey, and came up with clam. <laughs> Yeah, anyway, y'all. Any, don't y'all call me no clown. Listen, let me tell y'all something. Don't even try it, okay? Because I know what y'all thinking. Because somebody going to come up with the fake channel name, girl. They're going to come on here and call me a clown. Honey, you need to take that clown makeup off. You better not, honey, call me no clown here. Because if you call me a clown, I'm going to say, oh, thank you, boo. <laughs> All right, y'all. So, yeah. No food, no fun, y'all. Got to have some fun with this stuff. All right, so yeah, so that's how I achieve my look on my eyes, y'all. Oh, and I had took, now this is a um, a dual pencil, honey. Dual means it's something going on on both ends, okay? And on this end, honey, would be the eyeliner, okay? And on this end would be the eyeshadow, okay? So I just used this dual end, the eyeliner. Miss Ann, girl, I got me an eyeliner, honey. I did not take my lip liner pencil and do my eyes, honey. I am getting, I'm moving up, honey, okay? This is an official eyeliner. So I took this in, y'all, and I did my little eyeliner, y'all. See, y'all, mm-hmm. I didn't have any need for this in, so. Then, y'all, I took my, um, oh, let me show y'all, honey. I did some contouring, honey, in my contour area, okay? Now, my daughter bought me this, okay, for Valentine's Day from Walmart. And it's called NYC Sun and Bronze Bronzing Powder, okay? Bam. So, I used this to, uh, bro well, I put some bronzer on my contour area, which would be, see that little dip? They say that's called your contour area, honey. So I did, I used this for that area. And honey, I got a special brush for that. It's an angle brush that I got from um, Dollar Tree. And I did my little contour area. I brought it up a little bit, you know. I ain't want to mess up my squiggly wigs, y'all. Y'all see my squiggly wigs, y'all. See, I ain't want to be messing around with my squiggly wigs. You know what I'm saying. So I did my contouring with that. I did my blush with LA Colors. Um... It's a pinkish looking blush. Rosy maybe looking. And I did that and I got a brush for that. I do use this especially for my blush. Oh honey, I just messed up a nail again. Mm. So I did this with my cheeks area and I kind of blended it. Blended it with the uh, contour. Okay. Or the bronzing powder. <laughs> honey, yeah. So that's how I achieved that. And then um, for my lips, y'all. I put some, um, let me show y'all what I did for my lips. I took, I got, and this little because I've used it before. This is kind of like a pinkish lip liner. And I'm sure I bought it from somewhere for a dollar a long time ago. And I lined my lips with that. I don't know if you can see it, okay? I lined my lips with that. And y'all know that I like to put a um, moisturizer on my lips, okay? Before I put lipstick or, or um, gloss on it. I told y'all that before. Got to go back in the archives, honey. Yeah. The moisturizer that I use is called uh, Chapstick, okay? Moisturizer, a.k.a. Chapstick, okay? Yeah, that's what I use. I got this from Sally's, y'all. 